So, Mamuka, you really want to know what I can do? No, Chief, no. I asked you to do something and you decided to do something else. Why? Chief, I did what you asked me to do. Honestly, I did it. You know, because you have failed in this very task, you are going to replace that woman. Chief, why are you talking like this now? See, just just give me another chance. I'll I'll go, I'll put I'll do it again, Chief, please. He did was not fair. The least you could have done was allow the lady see me. Eh? Why did you treat her like a total stranger? It was not necessary. That's exactly who she is. A total stranger to you and my family. She should not see you. She should go home. She only came to check if you are still alive or dead. Mom, how can you call Ozi a total stranger? Of course you know she's my woman. I don't like what you're doing, Mom. Woman of your status should not be behaving this way. You're too enlightened for this. It's not fair what you've done. It, does, it doesn't have to be fair. Life itself is not fair. If life was fair, you wouldn't be in this condition. Mom, why did you start talking like this? Well, you need to realize that I am a grown man, Mom. I'm a grown man. I am no longer your little boy. I'm now a grown man and I know what's best for me. <laughs> Teach me how to behave. Teach a woman of my status how to behave. Now let me tell you, no matter how much you think you're grown, you are still my son. I am your mother. And I know what is best for you. And not when it comes to love, mom. It is my life. In your case, I'll be involved. I won't let you mess up your life. Not even when I'm still here. Do you even know what you're saying? Don't you want me to rest in peace when I die? Do you want me to be turning in my grave? Is that what you want to get you? Why are you always talking about death, Mom? I've told you to stop it. I can't stop because that's what you want. You see, eh? The issue here is that the evil woman has unleashed the totality of her evil against you. This has absolutely nothing to do with me. It has. She kept saying you are the one who poisoned her son. And she's very bitter. Well, it is not her fault. It is that other woman's fault. Very simple tasks that she was given. Wiped them out of the face of the earth and she failed. But you don't need to bother yourself about that. Father, I'm going to handle it. I'm going to make her pay. Father, what are you saying? Who are you referring to? You don't need to bother yourself. Like I just said, everything is under my control. And everything is not just under control. I say it's under my control. And everything will be fine. What did you just say? And why is she always referring to you as an evil man? Father, what exactly did you do to her? As your mom, my daughter, I did not do anything. Am I an evil man? That one useless woman is referring to your father as an evil man. Does that make your father an evil man? Listen, forget about all this. It's a very long story. Very long story. Father, I have time. I need to hear that long story. The things are getting out of hand. I don't even like the fact that she always calls me names. When I don't even know what my offense is, what did I even do wrong? You didn't do anything. And I will plead with you not to allow yourself to be disturbed over nonsense. This, this is done issue. Forget about it like I told you. Also, she meant to say that she just started calling your names. Oh, Father, come on. I'm not a kid. I am an adult. Do you need to brace up and start talking? Father, you need to talk to me now. What is going on? Really? As in, you are not going to forget about this like I just advised you? Come on. Daddy, start talking. Forget about this. <laughs> ah. 
excuse me. <laughs> you really have to tell me the reason for all this. Did anyone die? <laughs> you mean you have not had? <laughs> Heard what? Ah. Uh. <laughs> Excuse me, madam. See, I am a woman who has a lot to do with her time. So if there's an issue, open up and tell me about it. Mamoka is dead. <laughs> what? What do you mean by Mamoka? What did you know about? Mamoka. What do you mean by dead? Mamoka now. The, the, the one that sells yam. Your friend. <laughs> Excuse me. Mamoka, my friend, dead. Is it not the same Mamoka I saw yesterday morning when I was going out? Excuse me, I hope you are not one of the rumor mongers we have in this village. Ah, I'm not a rumor monger. She was found dead along the road. Even people are still there where she was killed. You mean killed? By who? I don't know. Oh my God! Please, where did you see her? The road. Can you take me there? Y yes, we can go. Okay. Let's go. Okay, then. Don't you think you're overworking yourself for nothing? How can you even say that? Did you hear what I said at all? I heard everything you said. And I don't think that's reasonable enough for you to think your father is lying. Oh, and he stopped talking like a fool. I didn't say my father is lying. I only said he is covering something. And that's precisely the point. Perhaps he doesn't want you to uncover what it is you're trying to uncover. He has a good reason for that, don't you think? You're just good for nothing. I mean, why do I always have to call you when you, you, you're never helping matters? Oh, well, I'm not going to take offense to that. The truth is, I remain the only one who would always tell you the truth. Nothing but the truth. And that's why even when you decide not to call me again, you find yourself pushy to call me. You know it's not going to work between you and this guy. Get it, and no peace, sweetheart. Muka, my friend, who did this to you? Who has done this to you, my dear friend? Has this was so cruel? What did this poor woman do to you? Oh, Muka. No. What is wrong with you? Why are you crying? Is, is Okechuku okay? My daughter is my best friend. What happened? My best friend has been murdered though. She has been murdered. My best friend, the only one I can trust. She's the one that does everything for me. Comes around to keep me company most of the time. Are you kidding me? I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry about that, Mom. How did it happen? I don't know. I was just informed that her body was found lying along the roadside. I thought it was a lie. Because there was nothing wrong with that the last time we saw. Only for me to get there and found out that it was the truth. Just like that? <laughs> Too many abnormal things are not happening in Amanato. Who could have done a terrible thing like that? I don't know. So far, nobody knows anything. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Mommy, it's okay, please. You don't have to start crying like this. I don't want you to fall sick, please. It's okay. Alright? I don't even know what is happening now. I feel like my world is about to come to an end. No, mommy. <sighs> Do not say a thing like that. Your world is not coming to an end. Don't say that. Listen, mom, you have to calm down. Your son needs you now more than ever, remember? Please. I am so sorry about your friend. You don't understand. As it is right now, I don't even know where to start. 
I don't know why everything is just happening at the same time. Mommy, some days are like that. That is the way the world is. Ups and downs. Eh? But it will surely end one day. Hi, ah, it's okay, Chico. He's fine. Much better. Okay. I actually came to see how you're faring. I'll drop by at the hospital to see him. Um, I really have to be somewhere now. Oh, thank you very much, my child. You have done well. I really do appreciate. It's okay, ma'am. Thank you. But please promise me you won't cry again. Please. Uh, I'll try. Please, try not to. I, I, swear, I swear she's not here. I don't know where she is. I only want to leave a message to you. If anything, I mean anything, happens to my child, I will not only kill her, I will kill her slowly. Sir, 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 please, please. I promise you we're here. Don't kill me, please. I am not going to kill you. I am not here for you. Make sure you deliver my message to her. I say I'll tell her everything. I'll tell her everything. I won't leave anything out. You should hear everything you said. I will leave now. Close your eyes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, they are closed. They are still open. Are still ah, open. No, 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 sir. I cannot try that. Now my eyes are closed. Now, so, repeat what I said. So, so you, you said that. I, I should tell her that. That nothing, that she should make sure nothing happens to your child. That, that if anything happens to your child, that you will not only kill her, but you will kill her slowly. Yes, sir. Good. I trust you will not fail me. Nah, I swear I cannot try it now. You have always been a good girl. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Ah, 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 ah. Thank you, What happened? Jasper was here. He threatened you with an axe, huh? How did you know? He did the same to me. Ah, Jasper is becoming a beast. And what, what is it, what is business with my friend? Ah, babe, this guy almost killed me. Look, he left a message for you. He said I should tell you that you should not let anything happen to his child. That if anything happens to his child, he will not only kill you, but he will kill you slowly. He's stupid. Now he wants his child, huh? <laughs> I see. All right. He will have his child. That sense. But I, I am, I am sorry. Okay. I am sorry this happened. It's not as easy as you think, babe. This guy scared the daylight out of me. Uh, good thing he did not harm you. I'm sorry about that, but I promise you, he will pay. I'll make sure he pays. What is even wrong with Jasper? Stupid boy. Are you trying to tell me you're not scared of this guy? No, I'm not. I'm not. But I'm still going to deal with him. Mama, take it easy. Eh? It is well. Ah, what do do? Yeah. It's good you are here. How are you doing? Get some water. I'm happy to hear that. Um, why is Mama this sad? Uh, she lost um, her best friend today. She was murdered. Oh, sad. Mama, I am so sorry. Please accept my condolence. Thank you. What's the update? When am I... Did you speak with the doctor? When am I living here? Oh, yes. I spoke with the doctor and we agreed that you and Mama will not be going back to your house. Um, for now. Why? 
it's not safe. How? You, How? you remember the the soup Mama said got sour? Yes. yes. It wasn't just sour, it was poisoned. What? I mean, how? In my own house? How is that possible? That is why we said that the house is no longer safe for you, but... Yeah, but who could have poisoned the food? Exactly. Who else? <laughs> it's not far from the same person who caused this. But... Anyway, you both will be staying in my house for the meantime. Until this thing calms down. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Oh, thank you so much, my son. Eh? You're welcome, Mama. And it was also the governor's idea. Oh, yeah. They have been investigating this whole thing, and and the police will be starting with Chief Izuna Saul's house. Why? Why Chief Izuna Saul? Why? 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 Because his house was the last place he went. Right after this thing started. Oh, uh, yeah, I get it, but still that doesn't make him a suspect. Now. Why are you vouching for him? Why are you vouching for that evil man? <clears throat> they do continue, please. Well, Mama, that is the message, and it's a new development. We're heading out now, and I will see you all later. Oh, all right. Especially you, okay? Thanks, they do. Thank you, thank you. Oh, you're leaving already? Yes. All right. See you later. Take care. <sighs> Mama, I don't like what you're doing. I don't like what you're doing. <laughs> this is not this is not nice. What do you ever like? Have you ever liked anything? You see, in this matter, I'm not even going to argue with you. I won't argue with you. Thank God. People are beginning to see through my eyes. People are not beginning to see anything through your eyes. Mom, you have this in your head. Stop what you're doing. It's not nice. You're embarrassing the innocent man. Mm? Yes. Innocent indeed. What do you even know? What do you even know? <laughs> just go. It's not so innocent. Hmm? It's not only innocent, it's Vincent. Hmm. What do you even know? What do you know? Hmm. The truth is beginning to come out. Seriously, Janet. I'm beginning to see reasons with you. Uzioma is definitely going too far. Oh, really? <laughs> Thank God we are beginning to reason well. Yes. I mean, who does that? Huh? A commoner. A commoner like Uzioma blocking the princess. Huh? And that's for a man she doesn't even love. Look, I'm waiting for her to come back, so I give her a piece of my mind. No. The only thing that you would tell her now is to free the SSA and not punish him with her witchcraft. What do you mean by witchcraft? Are you, are you suspecting Ozioma to be a witch? I am not only suspecting her. Ozioma is a witch. She's a witch by trying to stop true love. Mm -hmm. And what do you call true love? When a woman pushes herself to a man, is that true love? Can you do that? Can you do it? The answer is no, you can't. So why can't you allow someone who summoned courage to have her way? Huh? As for Ozioma, we will tell her that we know she's a witch. <laughs> I'm so baby, are you home alone? Yeah, I'm here alone. What is there? What? What was it? Nothing, I'm just, um, I've missed you. And, uh, and what? Nothing. You're unbuttoning my clothes. What do you know. want to do? Right here? No, come on. I know. Come on. No, no. no, you can't. You can't do this here. You cannot. No, you can't. You can't. You no. Can't. No, no, you can't. Oh no. For two reasons. First, this is not my place. Okay, remember. And then secondly, you know, I have a lot going on in my head right now. And that's why you need me. Let me take care of you. Okay, yeah. listen, I, listen, no, look, I, mm. look, I know, I know that you missed me. I've missed you too. But you know, there are a lot of other things we could do together, you know. I mean, it doesn't have to be sex right here. Really? Yeah.
Did you search everywhere? Yes, sir. Search very well. Yes, sir. Are you this anybody? Yes, sir. Okay, let's go. The indoor man. For how long are you going to be here? For as long as it takes for me to get on my feet completely again. You know that uh, that poison did a lot of damage. But the doctor was nice enough to prescribe some some tablets, you know, that just helps to cleanse my system and also build my immune system. But it's it's drowsy. You know, every time I take it I feel like I should just rest my head. So for safety I just choose to be in those. But I'll be fine. Mm. Okay, guess what? what? Mm. <laughs> Maybe you're going to like this. What is this? What? I'm carrying our baby. Yes, I can see that. Okay. I'm happy for you. Oh, no, no. It should be, I am happy for us. It's our baby. Yeah, of course, I'm happy quite all right. Mm -hmm. um, when, did, when did you, you know, when did you notice this? After I went for a text. <laughs> Is that so? Yes. Honey, are you sure I'm responsible for this pregnancy? Babe, what, what kind of question is that? <laughs> are you not my man? Babe, you put it in here. I'm carrying our baby. I'm just, you know, asking to be sure if, you know, you know, this belongs to us. You and I, you know, if I'm responsible for this pregnancy, I'm just checking. What are you trying to say? I'm just being meticulous. Is that all you have to say to me? You know that she confirmed that she's pregnant is not a problem. I mean, any woman can be pregnant. But the question begging for an answer here is are you responsible for the pregnancy? Come on now, Nedu. How can you ask me something like that? You know that I'm not. I haven't been with her in months, you know. Well, in that case, you have nothing to worry about. Nothing. I've just been wondering about what? Just been wondering why she would want to pin this pregnancy on me. You know this is a tricky situation, right? You know we live in a world where people agree with women. I have to be careful. I don't want my name dragged in the mud. I don't want a scandal. I, you know, I, I don't want anything to be a dent on my image. I do. You get it? Absolutely, my friend. But you see, as long as you know you're standing this, I don't think that would be a problem. Let her be. Let her carry the pregnancy until when it's time for delivery. And then after delivery, we'll find out the truth. I'm beginning to understand this whole thing now. <laughs> understand what exactly? Uh, you know, I told you she came here a couple of days ago to see me. She wanted sex. Oh yeah. You know, she she wanted us to, you know, mm -hmm. to do it. 
here. Did you succumb? Come on, no, of course you know I did not. It was all strange. You know, I couldn't, I couldn't understand why she wanted it. I, I, I did not do it. But I'm just saying that it's beginning to add up. You get my point? Of course I do. But I will say this, it's still not a problem. Just do what I said. I hear you. Hmm. If at the end of the day I'm not responsible for that pregnancy, I'm never going to forget. I won't forget this. I won't forgive Osioma. I will not. I, I stood by that girl when everybody told me she was bad. I would never forgive. Isn't it obvious? The child is obviously not yours. Right. I mean, judging from everything you've said here, she's actually carrying another man's child. That pregnancy is not yours. At least it's a pointer to the fact that you can now see the true nature of the one you have been trusting all these years. Okay, yes, I get your point, but please, please, please. Do not capitalize on this to say so many other things. I am not saying so many other things, bro. Listen, I am just saying what every right thinking person will understand. So please don't change the topic. Don't twist it. Princess, where are you going? I can't do it. Take my own. Mama, Mama, please. It's okay. Please stop crying. Please. Like when is this operation going to be? In two days' time. And the doctor said if it is not done, he will die. <sighs> um. Process to this thing. You see, the doctor said yours is not a match. Well, that notwithstanding, no matter what it is, we will try to convince him to buy one. But he even said he can't buy. That's what he said. Mama, don't worry. Just <gasps> don't worry. I will find a way. I think I need to be on my way now. Let me try and see the doctor. Ah. Hmm? What is the baby? Mama, please. Okay, just be strong. Everything just happened at the same time. It's all right, be strong. I'll see you. Mom, tell me who did you offend? Who did my son offend? Why is all this thing happening to you? I can't leave him in this condition. What do I do? Even the mother did not order me to leave. She now knows I can be of help. 
if I am ever going to win this war, this is my best time. You will do no such thing. Not in this house and not while I'm still alive. Are you mad? Do you want to kill me? Father, nobody is dying. It's just one of my kidneys and that's all. We can survive with one. So giving up one is not a problem. I can see you are going insane. Now, get into your room. Now! Hi. This is not happening. Circumstances shall the princess leave this palace unless I say so. It is a direct instruction. Can you hear me? Uh, listen, if it warrants force, use force. Don't let her get out of this palace for anything at all. Yeah. Is not the reason I must do this. He can as well marry the person he loves. But I will have to do this because of what I feel for him. The only man I consider good enough as a husband. Father, Father, you really have to find a way to understand that I'm going to do this. I must do this. Sierra. What is it? What is the problem? Why did you call me out? The king has just given an order that will surely get the princess mad at me. And that's, I want you to help me. What order is that? He said we should not allow the princess to leave this palace. And he also said we can apply force if necessary to restrict her. Can you possibly do that without assaulting her? That is why I called you to help me talk to her. So that she will stay in her chambers without coming out. How, how possible is that? Eh? See, I don't want to get involved. Please, do what you need to do. How you feel. And don't make me part of it. The princess have stopped relating with me ever since I pleaded with her to stop throwing herself at that man. Please, don't make me part of it. Please. They will be the same one to say we have assaulted the princess. How am I going to solve this now? You must be aware. Absolutely gorgeous. Good to go. What is this? Who locked my door? My princess, I'm here. What do you mean you're here? Why would you lock my door? Open it now! My princess, it is the king's order. He orders for the door to be locked that you shouldn't be allowed to go out today. Are you kidding me or what? Okay. Go call my father for me. Ah, my princess, you know the tradition. No one has the right to summon the king like that. Okay, if no one can summon the king, then open the damn door! I'm sorry, my princess. It is an order from the king and I can't disobey. And this is an order from the princess of this land. Go call my father, you this idiot! My princess, he already left. I am so going to deal with you when I come out of this place. You're messing 
wrong with me and you don't know. Listen, I will make sure you're relieved of your duties. Can you open this door now? I'm sorry, my princess. It is not within my power to open the door for you. Oh, you must be a very, very stupid man. It is not within your power to, to, to open the door, but it is within your power to lock me in here. I swear I am so going to deal with you. Open this door! My princess, I think you should call the king. He will call me to open the door for you. Frustration is this. <laughs> Let me go and tell the doctor to come and take my own. Mama, Mama, please. Nothing will happen to him. What do you mean nothing will happen to him? When the doctor said after today I will not see my son again. So this has been your plan all through, Millicent to Uzonko, to kill my only child for me. What wrong did my daughter do in loving your son that you people want to kill her? Anyway, I'm here to inform you that she will not be coming because I have done the needful. <laughs> I'm very sorry. Please forgive me. I don't want to kill the princess. It is condition. And there is no other alternative than looking for who will die for your son. Your, your Majesty, she has been willing to give hers for him. In fact, a few minutes before your arrival, she offered to give her own, but the doctor declined. Well, I cannot allow my only child to sacrifice her life for your son. Help! 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 you to help me deliver this to Okechukwu. Why? Don't worry. Everything is explained in it. He will understand. Can you at least tell me where you're going? I... I'm going to somewhere Jasper will not find me. Wait. Don't tell me you're running away from Jasper. C come, girlfriend. I think you should Talk to your father. Your father should be able to do something about this. Yes, you're right, but I don't think it's a good idea. Girl, I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. I really do wish I can help, but I'm handicapped. I understand. And I'll be fine. Just take care of yourself. And you take care of yourself and the baby too, please. I'll call you, okay? Yes. Please be fine, okay? Sure, I'll check. Wait, please take care, okay? I'll call you. Please take care. Thank you. This is very important to me. You'll get it. Bye, dear. Doctor, please, please, is there nothing we can do? I don't understand. I've explained this to you before, isn't it? Try and convince any of the ladies there is a perfect match with it. I would have actually wanted and preferred the princess's organ working in my friend. But right now, as it is, the king has barred her from coming. So I do not... I don't even know what else to do. Then forget about her and settle for the other one. Anyway, um, let me know when she's here. The one you're talking about. I don't even have an idea as to why she is not yet here. And I don't even have the motivation to put a call across to her. Well, anyway, I think he is still in a stable condition right now. We may wait a little bit longer. 
doctor. Why can't my own walk? Am I not a man? Why? It is. Are called, you preferring that of the ladies? It is called silence. Nothing to be confused here. Theirs match with his. Let me know when they are here. Sincerely, this whole thing is just beginning to get me more confused and confused. Okay. Can't we fly him abroad? Alice, let's get this thing done. It's an emergency, the, 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 the way you're putting it. Even when you fly him abroad, you will still need a donor. Remember that? Uh huh. And the process over there might be so complicated. The donor might be asking for money in hard currency. Hard currency, remember? So you can see why I said that doing it here is much better. Yes. <sighs> Seriously, I, I'm confused. This is the first time I'm meeting up with a situation that I don't know what to do. No worry, your friend will be fine in this case. You know how difficult it is to pull me out of the hospital at this time when I need to be at my friend's side. So sorry, please. It's, it's just very important I deliver a message to him. Well, you sounded like it was really urgent. Anyway, let me have the message. I'll deliver it to him. This is from Uzuma for Ketriko, please. Make sure he gets to him. It's very important. She said you will understand when it goes through. It's alright, in that case, he will get it. Thank you. Um, how is he doing? He's getting better. Well, we cannot say for sure. We are only hopeful. Oh my. It's okay. Please do take care, okay? And make sure he gets it, please. Like I said, he will get it. Thank you. <sighs> wow. This is good. <laughs> Wait. Um, what is good, doctor? Is she coming? I mean, is Ozioma coming? No. But I guess it worked. What worked? <laughs> Don't worry. You will understand everything soon. Let's go and see. I don't understand anything. And why are you excited? Why are you smiling? I don't want my friend to die. This is not a smiling matter. I said your friend will be fine. He will not die. You're obviously still smiling. You're supposed to be tense, doctor. You're about losing a patient. My friend. <laughs> you see, I am not losing anyone. Like I said, your friend is fine. Let's go and see him. I, I, there is something you're not telling me. Can we go? Let's go. I don't know what happened. You remember 
mean them, Doctor. I am sorry. Doctor, please, please, God will send somebody that will, that will, that will help us, please, Doctor, please. Doctor, please. Doctor, please. Doctor, please don't give up on my son. Doctor, Doctor please now. Why are you removing these things? He's still alive. I am sorry. Your son will explain better. I, I, no, 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 no. This I am sorry is what is Doctor, getting me agitated. What, what are you sorry about? Are you mocking me? <laughs> he will explain better. Sorry, I'm here, please. <laughs> Just um, okay, Chuku. suddenly got well. Okay, Chuku. Okay, Chuku. What happened? Okay, Chuku, Mom. Settle down, everybody. <laughs> settle down. Mama, 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 please. Settle down. Settle down. Settle down. Settle down. Please don't settle tell down. me to settle down. Just I can't start talking. Yes, explain. Trust me, Sid. Trust me, Sid. Trust me. I'm okay here. Explain. I can explain. Just settle down. I'll explain this. I want to thank you, especially for what you did for us. I want to thank you for helping us. You see, a lot of people in your position would have accepted the offer from Chief Izunaso, but you chose to stay back. You stayed back and you spoke the truth without even expecting a reward. That's quite shocking. <laughs> and you know, that got me talking with the governor and he told me that for your kindness, he would reward you with a job at the government house. Me? Yes. Yes, you. You. You are a decent citizen of this world. How I wish most people are like you. Thank you so much. I don't even know how to thank you. <laughs> it's okay. You deserve it. You saved our lives. So, we owe you a whole lot. I'm really grateful for this. Uh, well, uh, we should be the ones grateful for your kindness. I mean, we, we should be doing more for you. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> so, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, and I also want to take this time to say that, look, you are now a member of this family. Okay, feel free to stop by. Whatever it is that you want, you, you're free to come here. If there's anything at all, anything at all you feel that we can do for you here, do not hesitate to speak up. Okay. That's how for me. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate. You know what? Uh, let me get you something. Come on. <laughs> 